Hey, it's Ninja Boy. Welcome back once again to Yoshi's Revenge. So, Koopa Castle here. Might be wondering why I'm back. I was mentioned that you can actually go in this pipe. For whatever reason, when I jumped at it, it didn't let me in. But, you get this. Play through Super Mario Bros. 1 as a Koopa. World 1, 3, 5, and 6. So, I'm guessing World 1... Uh, three, five, and six. So, yeah, this is a little, like, extra thing. Um, I'm going to just check it out now, because apparently it's, like, one hit, one, like, you only have one hit. You don't get, uh, fire, well, you get, there are fire flowers, but you can't use them. Let me up there. Let's see. Is... The... There it is. So, for a remake... That, this box is actually supposed to be over. It's supposed to be, like, even with the edge right there. Um, yeah, for a remake, this is actually pretty interesting because it's a... a take on the original with playing as a Koopa, but at the same time, it's kind of... I don't know, kind of lame, to be honest. Because I've, I've never been a huge fan of you need to, or a huge fan of the remakes and all that. So, let's see. Plus, Super Mario Brothers 1 was extremely easy to, uh, get through. I mean, look. I can do this. Because I can go back and get enough momentum and just go across the top here. Avoid all of those piranha plants and all that. And then those are just folly fall things. And there's no hidden warp zone. Probably shorten that to try and discourage people from trying to get up there. These you can actually walk through, unlike the original game where you could not actually walk through them. That falls... That was a very, it's kind of a scary jump, but at least it's more than just one, uh, one level, I have to say. Do, do, the fire bars, still pretty easy to avoid. You, yes, you did. You added in the coins. On, okay. Oh, freaking. Uh, one, one hit. Really, one hit to do this. Uh, well, not even a hit. I have, like, zero chances. So, let's do that. Three up moon and three up moon all the way. And, yeah. Well, that was... That was that. I mean, that was really kind of easy, to be honest. Whee! Okay, enough of that. Little bonus area. So over time, I will. I'll do those probably after, probably like per world or whatever. If I get the switch, I'll finish that world, then go back and beat beat those. Probably sounds like a good idea. Did I ever get the... No, I didn't because I need the uh, red switch for that. Monsoon! Let's see. This water is not salty. Why do I not have a cake? What? Wait, 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 wait. Why did that get rid of my cake? That should not have happened. That is stupid. I'm I'm not a big fan of that. That should that really should not be how that works at all ever. No matter what game. Let's see. I'm supposed to have the red switch 
to make that easier, I guess. I mean, I can just wait for the tide. Look at that. So easy. Bam. Midway. With the Goomba. Freaking Goomba. Ah. Turtles. Turtles every mole. Turtles and moles. Bam. Okay, get up here. Come across here. And down this pipe. Going to be the end. Okay, 20. Two points away from the end. Eight bit lake. And by two points away from the end, I mean two points away from getting a bonus. Look at that Goomba. He's all like funny and whatever. You fall in the water. Hmm. Very. So it's it's a double exited level. So I guess taking the upper path here first to try and uh, I guess find the direction I need to go in. Oh, great scrolling bit. No, no, no. There. Much better. Why did I switch to my fire flower? Because it will actually be a lot easier and more helpful than the cape at this point, because I can fry enemies. Midway point, not sure if I really wanted that or not. That's just like a death trap there. Ooh, this looks like a spot I would want to use a P switch. There's a turtle. Die, turtle. No one loves you. Okay, so. Yes, I'm playing Mario. Well, here's the secret exit. So I guess. That will lead over to on the poop deck, but 8-bit lake, back. And I'm back! So, that's where the door was. I'm going to ignore it. Got my P-switch because it helps me swim. Okay, I'm just spit fire. Friggin' flying fish. No one let Spiny? Okay. I didn't even notice you. I'll just, yeah, I'll just stay back here and just fire my fireballs. Until I'm forced to move to this side of the screen. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Fire my fireballs at all of you. Oh, fly- okay, never mind. I was gonna say it looks like they've stopped, but no, they in fact did not stop. And I'm back here. Whee! No! No! Why couldn't I have gotten a- a thing? A majig? One-up. That's what- it, yeah. That's what it's called, a one-up. And we go into the little castle thing. Which leads to a castle! Which... I'm gonna go over here. To on the poop deck. Which... I, okay, that is a climbable surface. This is looking like an airship that went down. And it's kind of destroyed, but... I have... I don't know. Not a huge fan of the... Uh... Wait, wait, wait. That is weird. Anyway, as I was saying, the, sp the spikes, the broken bits of the ship, they're just rotated. Uh, and so the, the bottom half doesn't look right because it's not colored right and it's not the same as all the rest because it's just the upper portion flipped upside down. Pretty much about it. What are these blue coins? I'm curious. I must collect them. 
Oh, they just lead to a mushroom. No one cares about you, mushroom. No one. But these ones. These ones might be of importance. No, no, they're not. Why would you be here? No one cares about you. Hello, boo. So I need a P switch, it seems. Possibly from over here? Yes. How was I supposed to get in there if I didn't have a cape? That's what I want to know. That big boo has like all funky eyes. Anyway. Ow! I thought I was underwater, but I really am not. Stupid s diagonal bill shooter. So, this is looking like I'll need a P-switch to get a silver P-switch to be able to get to the door. Something like that. Hmm. Curious. There's a reset pipe and a reset door. So, get up here. Epic smiley face, something like that. Wow, oh, this really wasn't that hard. Okay. And then fuzzy, fuzzy man guy, sir. Another fuzzy man guy, sir. A third fuzzy... So many fuzzies! And things that hurt me. Why is that one all, like, fancy and the other ones are, like, normal bullets? That's all I want to know. Why is that floating? Should not be floating. What? How did that hurt me? Oh no. There are very odd things going on here. Spinning, spinning! Over this way. Okay. Wow, that cannon's not even on anything. Huh. Okay. Do, do this is kind of boring, actually, because there's just cannons, a few enemies here and there, and just jumping. Wow. Won't even lie, this one is kind of just boring. And a goal sphere. Which leads up to the Star Road, which I guess I will do next time. This has been Ninja Boy, and I'll be back later. See you guys.